Hello everyone, welcome to Quick Code Academy. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to store object into local storage. So when we are storing string in local storage, at that time it is simple. But when it comes to object format, so it becomes quite tricky. So in this video, I'm going to show you that. So first I will show you what code I have written. So here I have one variable as value. Within that I'm storing string. And here I'm setting one key as name with the value as variable and then here I am getting that stored value of key name and here I am consoling that so as of now let's see what output I am getting so see I am getting stored value as John so that is proper but now if I try to convert this in the form of object let's see what happens so here I am storing John like this okay and now let's see whether it is getting set or not. So now see, we are getting something like this object object, but we don't want that, right? So what we can do? So first of first of all, whenever you want to store something in local storage, so that should be in string format, right? So what will we will have to do is we need to convert this value to into string. So how we can do that? We can create one more variable as two to string value something like that you can give any name what you want and here we are going to convert it into string so how to convert that so we have inbuilt method as json dot stringify and within that we can pass this variable now here i will store this one so let's see what we we are getting on the browser now so now you will able to see name is equal to John so we are not getting object object now so now there is one more problem so what if I want to check only this key of this object so let's see whether it is possible or not so here I am trying to do something like this a dot name right because we need to access that key so let's see what issue we will get we are getting it as undefined why because it is still in the format of string and we are trying to access key of string so that is not possible in javascript so what we can do in this case so here we can convert back it into object so how we can do that so we can simply add one one thing like this json so let's do it on the this line so let object is equal to json dot parse and we will pass that variable as a and now let's see to access the object dot name so here we are now able to access the key of object so whenever you want to store object into local storage at that time first you will have to convert that object into string and we can do this by using json dot stringify and then we can set the property and when we want to read it at that time we need to use json.pass method to convert that string back into the object format and in that way you will able to access the key of the object so thank you for watching this video i hope you like it make sure to subscribe to this channel thank you